It's finally here, the day we've all been waiting in anticipation for, race day. The Autodromo Jose Carlos Pache circuit has been home to many exciting events in motorsport history, and I have no doubt today will be just as memorable. This high altitude anti-clockwise circuit is made up of just 15 corners and offers plenty of DRS opportunities, but not as much opportunity to overtake as you would expect. The circuit is known for its very technical sector two, which is sandwiched between the circuit's two long straights, the latter of which is considered to be one of the longest full throttle stretches you'll find. As we await the start of another hugely anticipated Formula 2 race, I'm joined again by Davide Valsecchi. Davide, as a former GP2 champion, can we get some insight to what is running through these young drivers' heads as they sit out on the grid? Ciao, Alex. It's a pleasure to be here. There are nervy moments. There is no doubts about that. Mental strength is the key to remaining calm and focusing on the upcoming race. Formula 2 is so competitive and all of these drivers know that they are going to be pushing each other all of the way. In these sports, you have to be able to control your nerves. We are nearly ready for the start of today's race, but in the meantime, let's take a look at the grid. Louis Delatraz lines up on pole position, and it's Sergio Sete Camera in P2. Looking down the rest of the grid, we have Matsushita, Giotto, Nikita Mazepin, and Correa, Eilot, De Vries, Latifi, Dorian Boccalacci, Galeo, Joe, Mick Schumacher, and Alessi, Rag Hunnathan, Aitken, King, and Antoine Hubert, Calderon, and Ralph Boschong completes the grid. And with preparations almost complete, let's head down to the track.
a great win then for the Carlin team today. And I have to wonder, Davide Valsecchi, just what set them apart from the competition here? I think this race was won thanks to the tyre management. You have to remember, it's not just about going as fast as you can. It's about consistency. It's about maintaining your speed over an entire race distance. So being able to keep the lap time competitive while still respecting the tires, that's where they won today. And there you have it, today's winners. Having raised some of the biggest names in F1 to date, Carlin have once again shown their expertise when it comes to recruiting new talent. No doubt today's winners have a bright future ahead of them. They certainly deserve it after today's performance. And so, driver of the day then, Davide Valsecchi, who do you think you'd go for? Let's give it to Luis Del Tras. That was a commanding performance today. Very impressive indeed. Goodbye for now then, but we really are just getting started. Make sure you join us again for Lights Out tomorrow.